Alright guys, I haven't made a video in a while. I've got a FN, FNX9 I'm gonna do a video on in a minute. Well, in a while, but... This actually excites me a little more. I'll show you why. It's a Walther P22. And it has been safety checked prior. I've only got one hand. It will not fire without the magazine in there. It's a 22 long rifle. It comes with two magazines. This one has rounds in it, but it's got the pinky extension right here. Comes with uh, adjustable back straps, but and a sight adjustment tool. Pretty affordable gun. It's like the SR22. Uh, it's got a safety if you want it. Picatinny rail. Ambidextrous uh, controls. But I just want to show you why I really like it. This is my tackle box gun. I haven't made any videos because I've been fishing. And this guy right here. As you can see, it fits right in my tackle box that I got from Academy. It's nothing special, but, you know, when you're out on public lakes or whatever, you never know, you might come across a snake or somebody and you just have it on you. But, I just wanted to kind of show off. It's a fun little, I shot it yesterday with my dad and it, it works well. It's a fun plinker. And, uh, I'm happy with it. I'm going to hold on to it for a while. Also been working on my 1022 here. It's got a, a tactical solutions trigger and an extended mag release. And I just need to get a scope for it, but this is a good truck gun. Plinker. Well, 22s are what I'm into right now. And I've been working on... This guy as well, Anderson build, but I just took the, I had mission first tactical stock on there and I just switched it with this just to, you get bored with the same look, cheap bush no red dot, but, you know, tackle box gun, Walther P22.